Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly and as you can see my hair is wet and not curled because in today's video I'm going to be styling my hair with some new products that I'm so excited to share with you guys. The products I'm going to be using today are from Wella. They're a brand new line called Nutri Curls. I think it's their first line ever for curly hair specifically. So I'm really excited because I got to be a part of the launch, a part of the campaign. How do you style your hair? I'm always looking for something to lock in that moisture. Great. This is amazing. Last summer, Willa invited me to London. That was my first time ever to Europe. I was so excited. I could not believe that they asked little old me to come and be a part of it. But um, we got to film some stuff, took some photos, took some videos, and now I'm a part of their launch. You can check it out on their website, on their Instagram page, and on their YouTube channel. I got the products right here. So we have their Nutri Curls shampoo, and this is a micellar shampoo. And I learned that micellar water is really good because it like grabs onto any like impurities, whether it's skincare or hair care. And it has these little droplets on the bottom to show how nourishing a product is, whether it's like lightweight or super, super nourishing. So this one is two out of three. So as you can see, it's moisturizing, but not heavy. So it's still pretty lightweight. And then we have their cleansing conditioner, which I really like. This is a super lightweight conditioner. You can use it every time you wash your hair. This is for waves and curls. They actually do have in their neutral curls Line. They have products specifically for waves as well, but the ones I'm going to be talking about are just for curls So anyways, this cleaning conditioner is really cool because you can use it when you wash with the shampoo And you can also use it as a co-wash. So I recently used it as a co-wash I posted a picture not too long ago on my Instagram page to show you a before and after look and I really loved what it did for my hair It made my hair super light and fluffy and this one also has a two out of three for the nourishment Then we have their mask. This is a deep treatment mask. It has a three out of three for nourishment and I like the mask because even though it is the most moisturizing it's still lightweight it doesn't like weigh my hair down or anything and then for the stylers so we have their fresh up anti frizz spray so this is a really light hold spray it gives you a touch of shine and you can also use it to refresh your curls then we have their curl elixir balm this is a defining cream very moisturizing so you can use this to style alone or with the next product and lastly I have their curl shaper 72 hour curl defining gel cream I personally am a gel person like I like having gels in my hair routine because I feel like it holds my curls the best so when I first saw the gel cream I wasn't a hundred percent sure but when I tried it I was so pleasantly surprised at the hold that it gives um, it is lightweight so they measure a two out of four in terms of hold I believe they have a mousse in this line too but it's not a part of this package here so we're gonna use what we got so I'm gonna start off washing my hair right here <laughs> using the shampoo and the conditioner and then I'm gonna style my hair so we're gonna start off with the micellar shampoo so this is a nice creamy consistency I'm just gonna rub this together and then I'm gonna work it into my scalp if you like shampoos that lather it has a pretty good lather as you can see So this shampoo is really clarifying, um, it cleanses my scalp and my hair really well. I feel like I have a fresh start when I use like really deep clarifying shampoos. Okay, so now that I worked that all into my scalp, I don't shampoo the bottom half of my hair because I find that to be the driest part of my hair. So I like to condition the bottom half and shampoo the top half. That's just how I do it. So now I'm going to rinse off the shampoo in my hair and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. I washed the shampoo out of my hair. Now for conditioner, I have the choice between using the cleansing conditioner or the mask. And I think today I'm gonna choose the mask. So for the cleansing conditioner, this is, like I said, a really lightweight conditioner. You can use it every time you condition. You can use it alone as a co-wash. I really like it. Both of these conditioners are silicone-free, by the way. So I'm going to use the mask today because I feel like my hair needs some extra moisture. Um, it has jojoba seed oil in it and a couple of other oils. So it looks like this. It's a thick and creamy consistency. So I'm going to take a good scoop of about this much. 
and add it to my hair. So I'm going to add it to the bottom half starting from the middle and working it into my ends. And the directions for this mask say to leave it on for about five minutes. If you need extra moisture, you can leave it on a little longer if you need. So as I add the mask into my hair, I like to detangle my hair. So I'm going to gently start detangling from the ends and working my way up. And look how quick it was to detangle my hair. Wow, my hair really drank up that mask. So now I'm going to clip my hair up and let the mask sit in my hair for five minutes. Get that moisture in there. Okay, so it's been a little over five minutes and my hair feels super duper silky smooth. Um, as you can see, I'm easily running my fingers through it and my hair was really knotty at first. So although the mask is pretty creamy, it's not heavy to the point where it sits like on top of my hair as you can see it absorbs right into my hair so my hair is coated by the mask but it's not weighed down at all so now i'm gonna go rinse it out of my hair and then we'll get ready to style okay i'm back my hair is nice and clean i rinsed out the conditioner now time for styling so i already detangled my hair it's not free but i like to use my denman brush to kind of smooth down my hair um, before I add the styling products to make sure that when I apply the products, my hair is frizz free and nice and smooth down. And as always, now I'm going to section my hair before applying the products. So first I'm gonna start off with the Curl Elixir Balm. And this is a moisturizing cream. It helps to define the curls. So I'm just gonna do one pump of that, not too much, because the next product I'm using is also like a gel cream as well. So I don't want to use too much cream to weigh down my hair. So I'm just gently raking this through my hair. The scent of the products um, from the shampoo, conditioner to the styling products are actually all the same. It does have a nice scent. It's kind of like a light floral kind of scent. A little bit perfumey, but it doesn't smell bad. And next I'm going to be using the curl shaper. So I'm going to give it a pump about that much rub it together so the gel cream is a little bit more tacky and that's because it gives your hair hold so I'm just going to rake that through and then I'm going to scrunch it in my hair okay and now I'm going to continue sectioning my hair and adding the products in the same way the curl balm is really light when you rub it into your hands it's super light it's not thick at all which I really like I love lightweight products it's just what works best for my hair Okay, so I added all the products in my hair. I just went to the sink really quick to add some more water to it because you want to make sure your hair is very, very wet when you're styling. The wetter, the better. So I'm going to add a little bit more of the gel cream to all of my hair together, upside down. Okay, so now that I scrunched my curls with the products in it, I'm going to dry my hair. So for this part, you can either air dry if you want or diffuse. I'm gonna do a little bit of both. I'm gonna air dry my hair for a little bit and then I'm going to fully diffuse my hair and show you guys the results. So 
my hair is finally dry and these are my results and I'm loving it. So before I complete this look, I'm going to add Wella's Fresh Up 72 Hour Anti-Frizz Spray. This spray is like a really light oil spray. It has castor oil in it and a couple of other oils. So the oil shoots straight, so you want to spray it on your hand first, not directly on your hair. So I'm going to spray a couple of sprays rub it into my hands and I'm gonna add it to my ends especially and then a little bit to the mid sections I'm not gonna add any to my roots because I don't want to add any kind of oil ever to my roots I have a lot of definition and volume at the same time which I love I can't stop fluffing it I love lightweight products like you guys know every time I review products I love when it's lightweight because that's what my hair needs to feel, you know, free, voluminous, bouncy, all that good stuff. Okay, so hopefully you love my results as much as I do, and you're probably wondering where can you get the products. So this is a global launch, meaning these products are eventually gonna be sold all over the world. So you can check Wella's website to see when your country is going to have the products available. Right now, if you live in the UK, they are available. If you live in the US, as most of you probably do, they're going to be available this September. I know it's quite a wait, but at least you can prepare yourself and be on the lookout when September comes. So if you live in a country where this line is available now, feel free to show off your results on Instagram, posting a before and after picture and hashtag free your curls so we can see your results. If you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe for more videos like this one. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified on when I post videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.